Perilla frutescens var. Crispa, also called shiso, from Japanese shiso, is a variety of species Perilla frutescens of the genus Perilla, belonging to the mint family, Lamiaceae. Shiso is a perennial plant that may be cultivated as an annual in temperate climates. The plant occurs in red-purple leaved and green-leaved forms. There are also frilly ruffled leaved forms, called churum and jiso, and forms that are red only on the bottom side, called katayman jiso. Names This herb has also been known in English as the beefsteak plant, possibly on account of the purple-leaved varieties evoking the bloody red color of meat. It is sometimes referred to by its genus name, Perilla, but this is ambiguous as it could also refer to a different cultigen, Perilla frutescens var. Frutescens, which is distinguished as egoma in Japan and tul kkae or wild sesame in Korea. The Perilla or beefsteak plant began to be recognized by the native Japanese name shiso among American diners of Japanese cuisine, especially aficionados of sushi in the later decades of the 20th century. In Japan, the cultigen is called shiso, zisu shiso iso. In Vietnam, it is called tia tu, tia tu. The Japanese name shiso and the Vietnamese tia tu are cognates, each loan words from zisu, zisu zisu which means perilla frutescens in Chinese, perilla frutescens var, crispa is called wiwisu, wei wei su wei wei su in Chinese, the first character z means purple, and the second su means to be resurrected, revived, rehabilitated. In Japan, shiso traditionally denoted the purple-red form. In recent years, green is considered typical, and red considered atypical. The red leaved form of shiso was introduced into the West around the 1850s, when the ornamental variety was usually referred to as P. nancanensis. This red leafed border plant eventually earned the English language name, beefsteak plant. Other common names include perilla mint, Chinese basil, and wild basil. The alias, wild coleus or summer coleus, probably describe ornamental varieties. The red shiso or su su types are called purple mint or purple mint plant. It is called rattlesnake weed in the Ozarks, because the sound the dried stalks make when disturbed along a footpath is similar to a rattlesnake's rattling sound. Origins and distribution Suggested native origins are mountainous terrains of India and China, although some books say Southeast Asia, Shiso spread throughout ancient China. One of the early mentions on record occurs in renowned physicians' extra records, Chinese, Ming Yi Bai Lu, Pinyin, Ming Yi Bai Lu, around 500 AD, where it is listed as Su, Su, and some of its uses are described. The perilla was introduced into Japan around the 8th to 9th centuries. The species was introduced into the Western horticulture as an ornamental and became widely naturalized and established in the United States and may be considered weedy or invasive. Description Though now lumped into a single species of polytypic character, the two cultigens continue to be regarded as distinct commodities in the Asian countries where they are most exploited. While they are morphologically similar, the modern strains are readily distinguishable. Accordingly, the description is used separately or comparatively for the cultivars. Shiso grows to 40 to 100 centimeters, 16 to 39 in tall. It has broad ovate leaves with pointy ends and serrated margins, arranged oppositely with long leaf stalks. Shiso's distinctive flavor comes from its paralaldehyde component, which present only in low concentration in other perilla varieties. The red-purple forms of the shiso, forma purpurea and crispa, come from its pigment, called perilla anthocyanin, or shisonin. The color is present in both sides of the leaves, the entire stalk, and flower buds, calyxes. The red crinkly leafed version, called Chirimanizo in Japan, was the form of shiso first examined by Western botany, and Carl Peter Thunberg named it P. crispa, the name meaning wavy or curly. That Latin name was later retained when the shiso was reclassed as a variety. Bicolored cultivars, var. Crispa forma discolor makino, katamengizo katamengizo, or katamen shiso, are red on the underside of the leaf. Green crinkly leafed cultivars, called Chirimenaujiso, form a variety crispa, are seen. 
Shiso produces harder, smaller seeds compared to other perilla varieties. Shiso seeds weigh about 1.5 grams per 1,000 seeds. Red Shiso The purple red type may be known as a kajizo, kai jiso hong, red shiso. It is often used for coloring umeboshi, English, pickled plum. The shiso leaf turns bright red when it reacts with the umazu, the vinegary brine that wells up from the plums after being pickled in their vats. The red pigment is identified as the perilla anthocyanin, aka shisonin. The mature red leaves make undesirable raw salad leaves, but germinated sprouts, or mijiso, yajiso have been long used as garnish to accent a Japanese dish, such as a plate of sashimi. The tiny pellets of flower buds hojiso, and seed pods fruits, can be scraped off using the chopstick or fingers and mixed into the soy sauce dip to add the distinct spicy flavor, especially to flavor fish. Green Shiso Bunches of green shiso leaves packaged in styrofoam trays can be found on supermarket shelves in Japan and Japanese food markets in the West. Earnest production of the leafy herb did not begin until the 1960s. Shimbo, 2001, p. 58. One anecdote is that c. 1961, a cooperative or guild of Suma garnish. Commodities based in Shizuoka Prefecture picked large-sized green leaves of shiso and shipped them to the Osaka market. They gained popularity such that obun, da, big leaf, became the trade name for bunches of picked green leaves. A dissenting account places its origin in the city of Toyohashi, Aichi, the foremost oba producer in the country, and claims Toyohashi. S. Greenhouse Horticultural Agricultural Cooperative experimented with planting C. 1955, and around 1962 started merchandising the leaf part as oba. In 1963 they organized cooperative sorting and sales of the crop Kiyosan Kiyohan Gong Zan Gong Fan analogous to cranberry cooperatives in the U.S. and C. 1970 they achieved year-round production. The word oba was originally a trade name and was not entered into the Shin Mikai Kokugo Jiten until its fifth edition, Kandaichi, 1997, and is absent from the fourth edition, 1989. This dictionary is more progressive than the Kojian cited previously, as Kandaichi. S. Dictionary, from the first ed., 1972, and definitely in the second ed., 1974, defined shiso as a plant with leaves of purple-green color. Chemical composition Shiso contain only about 25.2 to 25.7% lipid, but still contains a comparable 60% ratio of ALA. The plant produces the natural product paraloxin, which is built around a 3-benzoxapin moiety. Paraloxin inhibits the enzyme cyclooxygenase with an IC50 of 23.2 μm. Non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs like aspirin and ibuprofen also work by inhibiting the cyclooxygenase enzyme family. Of the known chemotypes of perilla, PA, main component, paraldehyde, is the only one used for culinary purposes. Other chemotypes are PK, perilla ketone, EK, escholzia ketone, place perilene, PP, phenylpropanoids, miristicin, dilipiole, elamycin, C, citral, and a type rich in rosefurin. Perilla ketone is toxic to some animals. When cattle and horses consume purple mint of the PK chemotype, while grazing in fields in which it grows, the perilla ketone causes pulmonary edema, leading to a condition sometimes called perilla mint toxicosis. The oxym of paraldehyde is used as an artificial sweetener in Japan, as it is about 2,000 times sweeter than sucrose. The pronounced flavor and aroma of shiso derives from paraldehyde, but this substance is lacking in the wild sesame and sesame leaf variety. Other aromatic essential oils present are limonene, caryophyllene, and farnesine. Many forms are rich in perilla ketone, which is a potent lung toxin to some livestock, though effects on humans remains to be studied. The artificial sweetener paralartine can be synthesized from paraldehyde, but it is used in Japan only for sweetening tobacco, despite being 2,000 times sweeter than sucrose, owing to its bitterness and aftertaste, and insolubility in water. Cultivation 
In temperate climates, the plant is self-sowing, but the seeds are not viable after long storage, and germination rates are low after a year. The weedy types have often lost the characteristic shiso fragrance and are not suited for eating, cf. perilla ketone. Also, the red leaves are not ordinarily served raw. Culinary use Japan Called shiso, zisu in Japanese, p. frutescens var, crisp leaves, seeds, and sprouts are used extensively in Japanese cuisine. Green leaves, called aujiso, ching zi, blue shiso, are used as a herb in cold noodle dishes, hiamugi and somen, cold tofu, hiyako, tataki and namero. Aujiso is also served fresh with sashimi. Purple leaves, called akajizo, kai zi, red shiso, are used to dye pickled plums, umeboshi. Shiso seed pods are salted and preserved to be used as a spice, while the germinated sprouts called mejizo, yazisu are used as garnish. The inflorescence of shiso, called hajizo, sui su is used as garnish on a sashimi plate. The Japanese name for the variety of perilla normally used in Japanese cuisine, perilla frutescens var. Crispa, is shiso. Z, this name is already commonplace in U.S. mass media's coverage of Japanese restaurants and cuisine. The Japanese call the green type aujiso, ching zi su or uba, big leaf and often eat the fresh leaves with sashimi, sliced raw fish, or cut them into thin strips in salads, spaghetti, and meat and fish dishes. It is also used as a savory herb in a variety of dishes, even as a pizza topping, initially it was used in place of basil. In the summer of 2009, Pepsi Japan released a seasonal flavored beverage, Pepsi Shiso. The Japanese shiso leaves grow in green, red, and bicolored forms, and crinkly, churum and jiso, varieties, as noted. Parts of the plants eaten are the leaves, flower and buds from the flower stalks, fruits and seeds, and sprouts. The purple form is called a kajizo, kai zisu red shiso, and is used to dye umeboshi, pickled ume, red or combined with ume paste in sushi to make umeshiso maki. It can also be used to make a sweet, red juice to enjoy during summer. Japanese use green shiso leaves raw with sashimi. Dried leaves are also infused to make tea. The red shiso leaf is not normally consumed fresh, but needs to be e.g. cured in salt. The pigment in the leaves turns from purple to bright red color when steeped in umazu, and is used to color and flavor umeboshi. An inflorescence of shiso, called hajizo, ear shiso, is typically used as garnish on a sashimi plate. The individual flowers can be stripped off the stem using the chopstick, adding its flavor to the soy sauce dip. The fruits of the shiso, shiso no mi, containing fine seeds, maricarp, about 1 mm or less in diameter, about the size of mustard seed, can be preserved in salt and used as a spice or condiment. Young leaves and flower buds are used for pickling in Japan and Taiwan. The other type of edible perilla, perilla frutescens, called egoma, ren hu ma is of limited culinary importance in Japan, though this is the variety commonly used in nearby Korea. The cultivar is known regionally as Junin in the Tohoku, northeast, regions of Japan. The term means, 10 years, supposedly because it adds this many years to one's lifespan. A preparation called Shingoro, made in Fukushima Prefecture, consists of half-pounded unsweet rice patties which are skewered, smeared with miso, blended with roasted and ground Junin seeds, and roasted over charcoal. The oil pressed from this plant was once used to fuel lamps in the Middle Ages. The warlord Saito Dosen, who started out in various occupations, was a peddler of this type of oil, rather than the more familiar rapeseed oil, according to a story by historical novelist Ryotaro Shiba. A whole leaf of green shiso is often used as a receptacle to hold wasabi, or various suma, garnishes, and ken, daikon radishes, etc., sliced into fine threads. It seems to have superseded barren, the serrated green plastic film, named after the aspidistra plant, once used in takeout sushi boxes. Green leaves The green leaf can be chopped and used as herb or condiment for an assortment of cold dishes such as cold noodles, hiamugi, somen, cold tofu, known as hiyako, tataki and namarachop leaves can be used to flavor any number of fillings or batter to be cooked, for use in warm dishes. 
A whole leaf battered on the obverse side is made into tempura. Whole leaves are often combined with shrimp or other fried items. Red leaves Red leaves are used for making pickled plum umeboshi, as mentioned, but this is no longer a yearly chore undertaken by the average household. Red shiso is used to color shiba zuk, a type of pickled eggplant served in Kyoto. Cucumber, mioga, and shiso seeds may also be used, Kyoto specialty. Seeds The seed pods or berries of the shiso may be salted and preserved like a spice. They can be combined with fine slivers of daikon to make a simple salad. One source from the 1960s says that oil expressed from shiso seeds was once used for deep frying purposes. Sprouts The germinated sprouts cotyledons, used as garnish are known as mejizo. Yeah, another reference refers to the mejizo as the mayashi sprout of the shiso. Any time it is mentioned that shiso buds are used, there is reason to suspect this is a mistranslation for sprouts. Since the word mi ya can mean either, though young buds or shoots are not usually used in restaurants, the mijiso used could be microgreen size. People engaged in growing their own shiso in planters refer to the pluck seedlings they have thinned as mejizo. Eucharith name Eucari refers to dried and pulverized red shiso flakes, and has become as a generic term, although Mishima Foods Co. insists it is the proprietary name for its products. The term Yukari no Iro has signified the color purple since the Heian period, based on a poem in the Kokan Wakashu, c. 910, about a Murasaki or Gromwell blooming in Musashino, an old name for the Tokyo area. Moreover, the term Murasaki no Yukari has been used as an alias for Lady Murasaki's romance of the Shining Prince. Furikake other than the Yukari variety, there are many commercial brand furikake type sprinkle seasoning products that contain shiso. They can be sprinkled on rice or mixed into musubi. They are often sprinkled on pasta. Shiso pasta can be made from fresh chopped leaves, sometimes combined with the crumbled roe of tarako. Rather than cooking the cod roe, the hot pasta is tossed into it. Korea P. Frutessens var. Crispa, called soyeob. Soyeob is a less popular culinary plant than P. frutessens in Korea. It is, however, a commonly seen wild plant, and the leaves are occasionally used as a som vegetable and a bibimbap ingredient. The purplish leaves are sometimes pickled in soy sauce or soybean paste as a jangaji, or deep fried with a thin coat of rice flour batter. Laos the purple leaves, called pak manga, are strong in fragrance, but not ruffled. They are used for Lao rice vermicelli, khao poon, which is very similar to the Vietnamese bun. They are used as part of the dish for their fragrance. Vietnam Tia Tu is a cultivated P. frutessens var, crispa in Vietnam, which compared to the Japanese shiso has slightly smaller leaves but much stronger aromatic flavor. It is native to Southeast Asia. Unlike the Perilla frutescens counterpart, the leaves on the Vietnamese Perilla have green color on the top side and purplish red on the bottom side. In North and South Vietnam, the Vietnamese Perilla are eaten raw or used in Vietnamese salads, soups, or stir-fried dishes. The strong flavors are perfect for cooking seafoods such as shrimp and fish dishes. Aromatic leaves are also widely used in pickling. Plants can be grown in open fields, gardens, or containers. Vietnamese cuisine uses a P. frutessens var, crispa variety similar to the Japanese perilla, but with greenish bronze on the top face and purple on the opposite face. The leaves are smaller and have a much stronger fragrance. In Vietnamese, it is called tia tu, derived from the characters zi su whose standard pronunciation in Vietnamese is tu tu. It is usually eaten as a garnish in rice vermicelli dishes called bun and a number of stews and simmered dishes. Ornamental use The red-leaved shiso, in earlier literature referred to as Perilla nankinensis, became available to gardening enthusiasts in England circa 1855. By 1862, the English were reporting overuse of this plant, and proposing coleus ver Sheffield tea, 
or Amaranthus melancholicus var, Ruber made available by J. G. Veitch as an alternative. It was introduced later in the United States, perhaps in the 1860s. Nutritional Bactericidal and preservative effects of the shiso, due to the presence of terpenes such as perilla alcohol, have been noted. Statistical data The bar graph shows the trend in total production of shiso in Japan. Source, Ministry of Agriculture, Forestry and Fishery Statistics. For green shiso, cumulative figures for shiso as vegetable is used, raw data starts from 1960, but for the shiso, the production figure was either negligible far less than 1,000 t, or unavailable until the year 1976, as shown. In the 1970s refrigerated storage and transport became available, bringing fresh produce and seafood to areas away from farms or seaports. Foods like sashimi became daily fare for Japanese people, and the green shiso leaves, developed as a garnish for sashimi, quickly began to gain ground. The number one producer of produce-type shiso among the 47 prefectures in Japan is Aichi Prefecture, boasting 3,852 tons, representing 37.0% of national production, based on latest available FY 2008 data. Another source uses greenhouse-grown production of 3,528 tons as the figure better representation actual OVA production, and according to this, the prefecture has a 56% share. The difference in percentage is an indicator that in Aichi, the leaves are 90% greenhouse produced, whereas nationwide the ratio is 60 to 40 in favor of indoors over open fields. As a forestated, Toyohashi, Aichi is the city which produces the most shiso vegetable in Japan. They are followed in ranking by Namagata, Ibaraki. There seems to be a growth spurt for shiso crops grown for industrial use. The data shows the following trend for crops targeted for oil and perfumery. See also Tantakadan Sources Explanatory notes References External links Portal site of official statistics of Japan. E. Stat Go JP. 2012. Archived from the original on the 31st of October 2013. Retrieved the 2nd of April 2012. This site is nominally available in English, but the search engine is not very robust.